Common misconception in America is that everybody is wealthy. But the truth is, 2.5 million people in the U.S. are homeless. 50 million people have no health insurance. 49 million people struggle to provide food for their family while simultaneously struggling with other challenges as well. This goes for Muslims and non-Muslims alike. Should Muslims play a role in the challenges facing our communities? Ikna relief is a way to follow the sunnah of our beloved Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam by helping the needy in the time of need, regardless of race or religion. Some of our programs include women's shelter, hunger prevention, health clinics, back to school programs, disaster response, and Muslim family services. How would you react if you knew that as a Muslim, you are living in a warm, comfortable home while your sister is spending a cold night out on the street because she has nowhere to go? On the street, her life and her faith are not safe. Ikna Relief builds shelters for sisters in that same condition. For some sisters, after the acceptance of Islam, their blood relatives abandoned them. As a Muslim, we ask you, wouldn't you like to welcome them into a big Muslim family? Ikna Relief helps sisters in this predicament. Ikna Relief's shelter provides a secure atmosphere where they can practice their religion with dignity and respect. We currently have five home facilities where we provide food, shelter, and job training. We have statistics of how many people we have served, but we do not have the number of how many we have been forced to refuse due to the lack of sufficient resource. Can we ask you a question? Why should we refuse sisters who need help when collectively we have the capacity to help them? With your support, we can make a big difference in the lives of our Muslim sisters. I have been at Igna Relief for six months and my accomplishment since I've been at Igna is I've gone to school, got Microsoft Words, get my pharma pharmacy tech, I'm a certified pharmacy technician. Thanks to Igna Relief for giving me a roof over my head, a room, a clean room, clean bed, and a place to live. One day, inshallah, when I am in the position, when I'm independent and I can stand on my two feet, I would love to help Ikna Relief and their organization because there are many women out there, there are many people out there who need help. So I'm going to be one of their big supporters in the future, inshallah. Ikna Relief has started the homeless shelter in New York and from that successful experience that how we can help emotionally and financially those sisters on the street and help them become a productive citizen of the country. 49 million Americans go to sleep hungry every night. Praise be to Allah, alhamdulillah. Ikna Relief is taking the fight against hunger to the front lines. I just want to let you guys know that I'm greatly appreciative of everything you guys come out here and do. The food is very excellent. It is very appreciated. And the service you do is a wonderful gift towards humanitarianism. Ikna Relief has 13 food pantries in addition to 15 cities with Feed the Hungry events that take place on a weekly basis. Ikna Relief Food Pantry serves Muslims and non-Muslims alike. Last year, Ikna Relief, with the help of Allah, fed 70,000 people with volunteer support and your valuable donations. Ikna Relief volunteers serve hot meals in the homes of the elderly. Every year in Idul Aha, we slaughter animals and distribute considerable amounts of meat to share the joy of this occasion with our less fortunate sisters and brothers. Fifty-nine million people who live in America do not have the basic necessity of health care. Many individuals and families cannot afford the cumbersome cost 
of a doctor or prescription medicine. Our Shifa clinic and our mobile clinic are providing services to the people truly in need. In developing communities, the Al Shifa Mobile Clinic serves a significant number of needy families. With your donations, we can keep adding other cities to our list. Putting a smile on a child's face is the best reward we can receive. The goal of the Back to School Giveaway Project is to enable every child to have a school bag before the school year begins. This provides relief to the parents and puts a smile on the face of our children. 18,000 book bags were distributed in 34 cities across the nation in 2011. Next year, our goal is to distribute 50,000 book bags with your help. Education is the passport to a positive future for tomorrow belongs to those who prepare for it today. When a natural disaster occurs, we know the chaos that comes in its wake and the struggles that people are forced to endure. ICNA Relief recognizes this challenge in America and has become a first responder for any disaster. ICNA Relief is the only Muslim organization which is nationally recognized. ICNA Relief has received local, state, and national recognition from governmental and non-governmental organizations. ICNA Relief helps to rebuild devastated communities and changes people's perception of what Islam truly is. ICNA Relief had taken that kind of a working agreement, uh, not only with Catholic Social Services, but to work with the people all over the country. Because there had been such a perception that Muslims were not as well entrenched and as working and as good to work with the Americans as the other people were. But when I got involved with my caseworker, Abdullah, I mean, they had a lot of conversations about Muslims and religion, and my the view totally changed towards Muslims. The, the media make Muslims look bad. FEMA had already told me they couldn't help me, and now this man that I don't know nothing about him, and he is a Muslim, and you know, you hear things. You know, you do hear things. And yeah, I was a little skeptical and a little scared, but after I talked to him, I realized that he was only here for my good. Ikna relief played a big role in recent natural disasters. We were in Birmingham, Alabama and Joplin, Missouri due to the tornado disaster. And we were on the scene in New Jersey in response to the hurricane floods. We are the face of Islam when a disaster hits America. In this materialistic society we are living in, Muslims are not immune to family issues and problems. Some Muslims are leaving their faith due to the lack of a proper understanding of Islam and spiritual weakness. ICNA Relief helps these families through Muslim Family Services by providing family counseling, foster care, and financial help when needed. We also have a hotline for emergency counseling. After completing the counseling, I decided to come back and give to the community. Alhamdulillah, to be able to help other people with similar issues. We had a lot of problems with my son, and uh, Alhamdulillah, when we came to the Ingrid Relief, everything was solved, and I never uh, felt better than ever. I have, you know, I had some problems in my life. You know, I've been dealt with the drugs, you know, smoking, going out with girls. Alhamdulillah, I found this place, Ikna Relief which is now has, has helped me and it continue does. And now I am, will continue my best and my best to work on myself as days go on, inshallah, and continue to help other people in the future, inshallah. I do believe that we need the services that it can relieve because uh, as Muslims in America, we have certain problems that are, are specific to issues in America. I will urge all the American Muslims to come forward and help us to help those who need our help the most.
We are serving the community for the pleasure of Allah and following in the footsteps of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. This is Dawah in Action. Are you ready to support a cause that will bring you closer to Allah and provide you the companionship of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam in Paradise? If so, please donate generously to the work of Ikhna Relief. Remembering the words of our beloved Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam who reportedly said, when the son or daughter of Adam dies, nothing will be of greater benefit to him than three things. A continuous charity, some useful knowledge he has left behind, or a child who will pray for him. May Allah bless all those who respond to this appeal. صلاتي عليك رسول السلام عليك السلام